And welcome back, guys. We're going to be playing some Dying Light 2 today. This is the last campaign, it's the last gameplay. Uh, so what are we doing today? So, I've been kind of just going around farming supplies. I've been also trying to level up the skills a little bit. And the issue we have for this windmill, for this quest, is... I've tried recording it previously. The guy's on top of the freaking windmill. So anyone that ha doesn't have the perk to jump farther up, literally can't jump up. So, we're stuck doing side quests until we get that parked unlocked, basically. Uh, pretty much. So, we'll probably do, try to do this as well. Uh, you know, try to get our skills up a bit. So, the skill that I think I need is this one here. But as you notice, we gotta level up this one, and then we gotta level up this one. So we gotta level it up twice. We're getting close to leveling it up right now. But yeah, that's pretty much what we're gonna be doing. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the support button. Let's get into some gameplay of Dying Light 2. Ugh. <sighs> 
So that's the pilgrim. Don't look like much of a sinner. Hey there. Rehearsing for the big night? Where did you come from, handsome? I heard you, uh, singing. Don't lie to Lola, sweet cheeks. Bet you thought someone was strangling a cat. Uh, not at all, I, I... See this, Nick? You shouldn't be able to. Usually, it's wrapped in the softest, most rare of mink stoles. Lola was the grand dame of the bazaar. But until reunited with her beloved mink stole, she is unfit to perform. But how will Lola dazzle anyone without her beloved mink stole? Without it, I can't hit the high notes. And you don't see mink scampering about everywhere, do you? Now where is it? Earlier, a strong gust of wind ripped it from Lola's tender throat and carried it away. I saw it flapping from the scaffolding near the GRE quarantine, at the intersection of Market and Horseshoe. Lola is powerless to retrieve it. Uh, I could. Would you? Lola could return to the bazaar to entertain, not frighten children like a lurking screamer. Well, we can't have that. No, indeed. Thank you, my knight in shining... Whatever it is that you're wearing, I shall await you at the bazaar. Hurry, my fans await. Almost had it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Oh, and it's gone again. Got it! Ugh, oh, this looks more like Squirrel than Mink. Well, I'd better get to the bazaar and give this to Lola. Got a gig as a finisher tomorrow. Someone's got to take care of the fighters and all this. The bots are killed, they barely notice. But when the commander is killed, they turn away. They lose all pumpkins. My brother thinks I should try growing medicine. Oh, here you go. My precious mink! Oh, you are truly sent from above. Lola is complete once more. You deserve a reward. Do you wish Lola to reward you with a song? Sure, why not? I sleep and I dream of your love. 
hill was sent from above <coughs> like a soft turtle dove. I wake to the touch of your lips, your hands on my hips. My heart does beg for lips. <coughs> Are you not hypnotized? Are you not enthralled by Lola's voice? <laughs> I am. That was otherworldly. Such a compliment. You were such a dear boy. And a terrible liar. But Lola appreciates your kindness. You deserve a more proper reward than a song anyway. Take this with Lola's deepest gratitude. <laughs> Thanks. Something you like in the bazaar? <laughs> this isn't kosher, Damien. You need to respect the rules. I'm respectful. No one's more respectful than me, I swear. I met Lucas several times. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen my kids in months because of this ridiculous blockade at the center. <laughs>
up on a third degree. Managed a PhD. Is everything all right? I can hear you a mile away. None of your business! Sorry about her. Save your sorry for Theodore. You better find him right now or else. Monica, maybe this is for the better. You don't get to tell me what's better. But I'm telling you, you better get Theodore out of there. Come on. Do you really want that? You think life is hell on Earth now? You wait and see how I make you feel if Theodore comes to any harm. So then, what happened that might be better this way? Yeah, tell him, Will. I... I couldn't watch. This brute hooking up with my sister and... Will, Lord Theodore, in a dark zone. And now he'll fucking go and get him out! Monica, wait. You're a pilgrim, right? That place is soaked with chemicals. Hell, Theodore's probably dead already. You want me dead too? Even if I manage to find him. The asshole will just kill me. Pilgrim, would you... Would you get that jerk out of there, please? Man, but you just said if he makes it out, he'll kill you. I have no choice. Look, there's more. I'm pregnant. I found out this morning. Theo doesn't know yet. Wow. Well, okay. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. He lives in an apartment on Old Shambles Street, about 200 meters north of here. Theodore should be on the first floor. Wait until nighttime. It'll be easier for you. Hopefully he's holed up somewhere away from the biters. And one more thing. I love Theodore, you know, but he really can be dangerous. Be careful.
you come closer and i'll kill you will and monica sent me fucking will you better fucking run i get out of here and he's dead me oh, wait calm down fucking rip his guts out and tie him in a fucking bow ah uh, oh actually um <sighs> monica's pregnant wait what with your kid wait are you telling me that I, I'm going to be? You're going to be a father. Well, fuck me. That's fantastic. A goddamn miracle. When you say so at the beginning. I would have, but you were a little, uh, worked up there at first. What if there's not only one? Maybe it's twins or triplets. What's your name? If it's a boy, I want to name him after you. Aiden. Aiden! Aiden Wintoon! Sounds perfect! Now get out of here. Monica's waiting. And Will... He has an apology for you. Nah. No apology needed. He was kidding around. Yeah. Like guys do. No harm, no foul. You leave him alone? You kidding me? Hurt my kids, uncle? But why would I go and do a thing like that? I better go propose to Monica. We don't get married. People will talk. People can be so cruel, you know?
The essence of survival? What are you talking about? Want to find out? Just close your eyes. What do you perceive? Well, um, I hear noises. Yeah? What else? Well, oh, something stinks. 
Exactly. The smell. Impulses going straight from the senses to the limbic system, triggering an emotional response. Memories. The well-being of the mind. But, uh, that smells like... Well, that smells like shit. What did you expect? What do you think people use as fertilizers around here? Too much information. Sorry. I sure hope you don't mean smelling like shit is the essence of survival. Of course not. I have this really exciting idea for a new fragrance. People are gonna pay a fortune for just a whiff. I called it Turn Me On. And it's almost finished. I just need some scraps for the heart note. A uh, heart note? Hmm. The middle note of the perfume. Metal scraps and lavender. That's all I'm missing. Oh, of course. Metal scraps and lavender. The obvious blend. Naira goes out of her way to be... controversial. If you bring me some, I'll tell you everything about my secret formula. Nara said she needs lavender for her perfume, too. Hm. Now that makes more sense. Metal scraps. Nara wants them. Oh, I hope this isn't some wild goose chase. Making perfume out of metal? <laughs> Sounds absurd. Here, your, uh, ingredients. Mmm, good. I wish there was more oil on the metal scraps, but... Oh, Naira, can't you just be thankful for what you've got for once? She gives me this shit every day, I swear. Okay. Okay. Voila! It's ready. Here, smell it. Wow. It smells... It's... Oh, boy, it's like heaven. What is it? Silly little boy. Too young to know, aren't you? It's new car smell. A... a car? Are you disappointed? The scent of luxury is the bass note, the smell of confidence is the heart note, and the fragrance of risk and adventure is the head note. All you dream about is to turn it on and drive away into the distance. Thanks so much for helping me out. Unlike some people. Here, have this. I rubbed it with Turn Me On. This will remind you to tune into your sense of smell now and then. Anyways, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you hit the support button. I'll see you again in the next video.